on the 9th of April 2022. The Academic Staff Union of Universities, ASU, through its official Twitter handle, stated that the union has no plan to reopen public universities in Nigeria anytime soon, challenging the federal government to make public the results of the integrity test it conducted on the University Transparency and Accountability Solution, UTAS. The union also has made it clear that the strike will not be suspended until the federal government of Nigeria accepts the option of UTAS, implements the renegotiated agreement, and pays all outstanding allowances. Remember that on the 14th of February 2022, the union had embarked on a one-month warning strike to pressure the federal government of Nigeria to meet its demand. The union is basically demanding for the renegotiation of the agreement it had with the federal government in 2009 and the sustainability of the university autonomy by deploying UTAS to replace the government's imposed IPPIs. The union also have other demands on the table, including funding for revitalization of public universities, poor funding of state universities and promotion areas, the release of the reports of visitation panels to federal universities, distortions in salary payment challenges, and end academic allowances. The strike that started on the 14th of February 2022 was supposed to be a four weeks warning strike. But exactly one month after the commencement of the warning strike, ASU and its members announced the rollover of the strike by two months, alleging that the government did not treat the matters involved with utmost urgency they deserved during the four week warning period as expected of a reasonable, responsible, and well-meaning administration. About a month into the rollover period, and about two months since the beginning of the strike, ASU is making it plain that there are no plans to reopen public universities in Nigeria anytime soon. In all of this, the question nobody is asking is, what happens to the Nigerian students who have spent the last two months out of school due to the battle between the federal government of Nigeria and the academic staff union? Maybe they don't care. Since its inception in 1999, the Academic Staff Union of Universities, HASU, has cumulatively gone on strike for over 15 months. What that means is it has gone on over four years of strike in its 23 years of existence. And as the popular African saying goes, when two elephants fight, it's the grass that gets trampled. Nigerian students have tried to show their displeasure in the ongoing strike through the National Association of Nigerian Students, NAS, and different protests and polls on Twitter. But neither party involved is listening to the cry of the students. As a matter of fact, the Minister of Education walked out on the executives of the National Association of Nigerian Students during a meeting. But what are you going to do as an individual to make the most of this strike period? For most students, this is going to be wasted months because they'll spend their time watching movies, chatting on social media, playing games, hanging out with friends, and all of that. Instead of wasting all of this precious time doing things that don't have value, you could maximize this strike period by learning a high-income digital skill. You are going to find these skills very useful during the strike, after the strike, and even when you are done with school. Learning something new also keeps your mind sharp so that your performance in school does not go down after the federal government and ASU battle ends. Learn skills like web designing and programming, copywriting, digital marketing, social media marketing, graphic design, videography, content marketing, public speaking, Acquire professional certificates to add to your CV. And if you already have these skills, now is the best time to start your own business. You have enough time to start your own agency, your blog, your YouTube channel, your online store, your freelancing business. Also, you can use this time to read books and watch CEO documentaries. In summary, what I'm trying to say is make the most of this period. This way, when school will eventually resume again, you'll be a better person than when the strike started. Did you enjoy this video? Hit the like button. Let me know what you think about the ongoing strike in the comment section. Also subscribe to the channel. On the channel, I create videos about online business. And make sure to turn on the notification bell so that I get notified anytime I upload a new video on this channel. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.